guys, check out the next level games for all your TCG needs. Link is down below in the description of the video. Thanks, guys. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Team Fish Knuckles YouTube channel. Today is Thursday, which is nothing special. We're just, you know, if you notice, Monday we played uh, we played Jolteon, Tuesday we played Vaporeon, Wednesday we did a uh, Leap Challenge video, and today we are looking at a very interesting Meganium deck. Now, Meganium is something we actually haven't showed off on this channel yet, um, because a lot of people were covering it at the time, but today what we're looking at is a Rhyperior Charizard Meganium Swamper deck. Yep, you heard me right. Um, basically, my friend Zach Samoir posted a post on Hey Fonte and said, Hey, if you have any standard events, you know, you want to look into this deck. You want to see how, you know, if you, if you want to see something spicy that, you know, does very well, then here you are, you came to the right deck. All right, so this is my first time playing the deck. Um, Zamora said I might mess up, and that's what we're going to see today. It's probably me messing up. But what we're going to try to do today is use Rhyperior's Toppling Wind, okay? Uh, basically it says, when you play this Pokemon for your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may discard the top three cards of your opponent's deck. And that's what we're going to try to do today is deck our opponent out. Now, Zamora said, your opponent's going to take two to three prize cards. They're going to have about 20 some of the prize cards left, and that is when you go into action. So there's a lot of stuff happening, right? So we get the right period. We're going to discard some cards, whatever. We're going to have Charizard. Uh, Charizard has the, a GX attack raging out. Discard the top 10 cards of your opponent's deck. So if your opponent doesn't know you're playing Charizard, you're good to go. At one point, you can just rage out, discard top two cards of your opponent's deck, which is good to go. Um, Celebi isn't there for time distortion. He said this is more for um, the Orangaroo decks and stuff like that, so you can keep de-evolving and put them back into your hand and stuff like that. Um, it's not 100% necessary. You're not supposed to be using Celebi Prism Star. It is for a speed-up process. The card you're supposed to have in the active is Rhyperior, um, so they can swing into it and you ace roll it and you're good to go. Uh, we're playing a 3-3 Meganium, and this is where the secret comes out, is with Meganium. Once during your turn, before you attack, you may use the ability, choose one of your basic Pokemon to play. If you have a Stage 2 card or hand that evolves from a Pokemon, put that card onto that base Pokemon to evolve it. You can use the ability during your first turn on a Pokemon that was put into play. So essentially what we're trying to do is you can Rare Candy the right period, discard 6 cards, Rare Candy into another right uh, Rhyperior on the bench, discard six cards. You can Ace Roll a one, um, discard another three cards, which is 19, or you can, you know, pick it up, use Meganium, discard another three, 19, and then you can use Rare Candy to Charizard and Rage Out for 10. So you can essentially do 19 energies in one turn um, in the grand scheme of things, right? So th that's what we got here. I know it seems cute, confusing, but I promise we'll explain it more as we play this deck. Um, Oranguru is not what you're using 100% of the time. Like I said, you're supposed to be attacking with a Rapierior. Oranguru is good to get back cards from your deck, obviously. Uh, two one nine tails. Nine tails is going to be good for the Mysterious Guidance. And a 3-3 Swampert. So basically what you're trying to do is get two Swamperts and two Meganiums. That is the point of the deck. Once you're there, you're good to go. Uh, we're playing two Looker's Whistle, Looker's Whistle, which I asked about it, and he said, well, you use Mysterious Guidance to grab Looker's Whistle so you draw more cards. Uh, four Nest Ball to find a Pokemon. One Palpat to get back our Sporter Cards. Four Rick Andies. We need those very, very bad. Two Stretchers, two Switch, two, three Timer Ball, and one Ultra Ball. There's a lot. There's not a lot of stuff you can discard here, so you need your Ultra Balls. Um, one Brooklyn Hill, of course, find your Volpixes and Mudkips. Town is really crucial because you can evolve your Rhyperiors. When they evolve, they take damage. And then you can use Acerola to pick it back up, um, which is right here. We got one Cynthia, which you really don't want to use unless you're about to deck out. Three Gladium, which is really nice because you need to make sure you don't have your Charizard, Char Charmander, Charizard, and your Super Boost prized. One Guzman to help stall. Four Lookers to draw cards, one Super Boost for Charizard, and three Rainbow Energies to help pick up your Pokemon, and of course to use like Time uh, Distortion and Resource Management. So we're going to play this game. Um, you're going to see some stuff probably as I figure out how this goes. Uh, so we're going to name it Meganium, and we don't even have a Meganium deck built. So this will be the first time we see Meganium played on this channel. I, whew, whew, I am nervous. I am nervous. Uh, Zamora said I am probably going to mess up. He said, but good luck. You got this. He said he still loves me. 
Evil we mess up. He said he grinds his out on the ladder and he is able to win a ton of games because all of a sudden you drop like 20 cards out of like and he said you can discard 25 within three turns very easily and if your opponent's not ready for this you can win games um so we're gonna play it kind of slow he said the bad cards he said bad cards are are um marsh shadows essentially like anything that can disrupt your hand that's what destroys you weevil is another bad thing as well but the bad thing is definitely going to be marsh shadow all right so, our hand looks terrible. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. It looks terrible already from the start. Good. Um, the point of the deck is to start beaconing early. You want to beacon as much as possible, right? You want to start finding a bunch of Pokemon. So, there's a Buzzwall. Um, Buzzwall is not too bad. Now, I mean, we can take a knockout with, like, a load of Ninetales, right? So, he puts out a Brickle for us to, you know, help us out here. Thank you, opponent. You're nice. <clears throat> You're friendly. You're helping us out here. Alright, so we see the Rock Ruff come down. Now, the Rock Ruff is kind of scary because it can one-shot us, but it only won't one-shot us one turn. That's it. So, Lily for three, or four, whatever. So, he's already drawn cards, right? 41. He doesn't know what's happening. He sees Celebi. He's like, alright, that's fine. We see an Ultra Ball. Going to discard a Brooklyn and Tapu Lele. So, I'm, I'm glad he has a Brooklyn out. We don't have to dig for it. We can Brooklyn and then Lookers and then switch, actually, into the Vulpix. <coughs> a Ringaroo, that's fine. Okay. See the Ringaroo coming down. We see them. Oh my goodness, let loose from the start. Alright. So he gets rid of our switch, which is definitely the key thing in that hand. Hmm. Okay. So we're gonna Brooklet for the Mudkip. So Charizard and Char. Okay, they're in there. Super boost is in there, so that's good. Okay, we have three Acerolas. We have a Rhyperior Prized, a Meganium. We have a Swamper Prize. So Swamper and Meganium are prized, which are two big crucial cards for sure. Uh, we're not gonna Mudkip, we're gonna have Vulpix. Thank you. Well, Looker. Okay, grab the Lookers. We'll look for three. We'll put on Chikorita. We will Nest Ball for Mudkip. Okay. We'll Rainbow Energy. Retreat. And Beacon. Alright, so with the Beacon, we are going to find... We got the Rickanium Meganium, which is nice. And then we get Swampered out, the Falling. Okay, so we'll get these two. Seems pretty good. We don't even need Ninetales right now. We can Rickany Meganium, get the Swamper, start power drawing, and then we're looking good from the start. Um, we can grab a, a, a Ninetales. Ninetales will allow us to um, basically, oh, 36. He's already down 36 cards, see? And you can't even watch my Vulpix right now. Which is nice. Okay. What I really need to find is our good friend Gladion. Okay, so is he a beast energy going to the active? Still. Oh no, he's gonna take a knockout here. Okay, 32 Chikorita. <laughs> we'll send up the Celebi. That's fine. Alright, so on our turn. We will rear candy into Meganium. Okay. We will use Quick Ripening Herb to get a Swamper. We'll power draw the Brooklyn Hill. Alrighty. So there is a Gladian. And with this Gladian, jeez Louise, look at these prize cards. Everything's so sick. Uh, I think they're right, oh my goodness. Yeah, right period. Uh, maybe that was the wrong one. Hmm, this is the weird thing. I, get, I never know what to really grab right now. Okay. 
five, ten. So I'm gonna nest ball. Oh, then the game is okay. Now it's right there. So grab the chikorita, okay. Now we have two things ready to go, and you know, let's purple hill from the mudkip. But it's Swampert's price. We should have grabbed Swampert, Josh. What are you thinking? Whatever, that's fine. We'll grab Mudkip, okay. Um, let's just press done right now. Okay, I want him to knock out the Celebi. That's, that's, I really want him to knock out the Celebi. But he can't right now, unfortunately. Okay. So 34 cards left. So, like, and this is the question. Will he keep playing aggressive? Or will he take us slow and just keep punching us? <clears throat> That's the question. We'll see. I'm waiting for him to use Lycanroc's GX attack. So we see a fighting drink the active. No impact is going to start hurting. I'm not gonna lie. Hmm. How do we do a buzzle? So Ultra Ball. Discards one and two. There's a Macargo. Okay, he gets smoother when he wants to. Which, I mean, even though he's got, like, the buzzwall, we can keep, like, stretching stuff back into our deck. Because he's not taking a knock out of here for sure. Okay, so Macargo's going to put something on the top of his deck. That's fine. Um, we get Timer Ball to find in the Meganium, which would be really nice. So Lily, all right, down to 29. He is already going places. Okay, so we see Jet Punch. Not taking a knockout. Maybe do some damage to Meganium. Sure. I'll give him that. Okay, to the uh, Mudkip. That's fine. We have 70 HP Mudkip. That's okay. So we get a switch here. Okay. So, hmm. This is the weird thing. What do we discard here? Do we let him knock out the Celebi first? Hmm. Interesting. It's a very weird hand. Um. Okay. So I'm gonna power draw. Just discard the looker. Draw three new cards. Okay. So we got the Rhyhorn. We can quick ripening herb the Rhyperior. Yes. Okay. <laughs> um. Man, another Megany Man Swamper. Like, we definitely should have grabbed the right barrier. Definitely should have grabbed that. Alright, so I think we just pressed done right now. Maybe we should have, like... Beacon and grab some more cards. I'm gonna switch into Vulpix and got some more stuff. Um, if he takes a knockout, we can maybe go another Hyperior. So he's still like discarding stuff, right? He's got 25 left. There's a Lycan Rock, so he's gonna bring up, bring up something and take a knockout. Uh, maybe the Mudkip and take a double knockout this turn, right? That's what I think is what we're gonna see here. Yep, there's the Mudkip. Gonna knock out the Mudkip, knock out the, the Celebi. There we see a Fighting Dragon Lock and Rock. He's got the Dangerous Rogue GX coming up. But he's down at 24 cards. Hmm. Alright, so we can grab another Rhyperior this turn. Okay. Let's find what's in the Rhyperior. <clears throat> On to our turn. Let's Brooklyn Hill for Rhyhorn. Well, Power Draw. Discard a Rare Candy. Hmm. Um, let's nest ball for a Vulpix. 
Switch into Vulpix. Beacon for one and two. Okay. All right, so our opponent's turn. Let's see what happens. Can he knock out the Swamper this turn? That's definitely what I'm scared of. Hmm. Oh. Just thinking about this. Okay, there's a Fighting G active. And there's a Guzma. Who's he going to bring up here? Bring up the Rhyhorn, which I'm fine with. Okay. So Dangerous Rogue, 250. Going down to two. We'll send up the Rhyperior. All right. We find a Guzma out of our own. We can Guzma bring up somebody. He's already played one Guzma. Okay. Huh. Let's rare cane into Meganium. Power draw away the timer ball. We get the Gladian, which doesn't really help us right now, unfortunately. Um we'll stretcher into our hand. Grab the right horn. <clears throat> Put down the Rhyhorn, click a Ripeny Herb into Rhyperior. Okay. We'll Guzma up the Macargo. Um, to send in a Rhyperior. Look a Whistle to thin our deck down. We haven't played a single Acerola, but he's got 20 cards left, okay? Hmm. Press done. All right, let's see what happens here. He's got the switch to the buzz wall. Very nice. I don't know how we're to win now, unfortunately. Um, the most we discard next turn is 13 that I'm aware of. And then you have th three price, you have three cards left. Um, I think our game plan is to tank with Charizard next turn. And I hope he doesn't have a Lycanroc. Or a Guzma. <laughs> uh, okay. You know, I got pretty much everything. Alright. So how do we want to do this? We'll send up... Um, the right here. I guess it really doesn't matter, right? Alright, so in our turn. Get a Nest Ball. Okay. So, what's Timer Ball? Tails and tails, great. Uh, okay, we should have seen the Vulpix no matter what. That was definitely a misplay there. Uh, we met, we definitely misplay. Should discard Chikorita. Okay, so this is a learning experience. I mean, he can't attack this turn. All right, he had the Guzma. Didn't matter. Energy retreat. He can just like sit up this guy and take a knockout. No? Yeah, he's in Buzzle. Okay, so we're, we're learning here. So we definitely had a lot of surprise. We had the um, other Swamper prize and stuff like that. Maybe we did the repair too early, but you kind of see how the deck goes, right? We are definitely slowly getting there. Um, all right, let's play against an easier deck, not against a uh, Buzzle deck that can one shot us because Squeaky doesn't know what he's doing, and he's definitely learning how to play this deck. Let's not do that again, Pokemon. Let's give Squeaky an easy matchup. Like a theme deck. <laughs> okay, Citra Lover. Okay. Alrighty. So let's see here. Alolan X, maybe? Hmm? I don't know. 
We'll see here. So we won the coin flip. Great, yes. I would love to go first. Oh no, our turn. <coughs> Alright, got a mulligan. I like that he put down the Brooklyn Hill turn one too. It kind of helped me out just a little bit. We didn't find any of these last game either. Which I don't know how relevant that would have been. Okay, so a Shrine of Punishment deck. Oh, so it's definitely a Lull of the Eggs deck. Huh. Hmm. Okay, press done. Okay. They're both weak to grass. <laughs> Alright, I think we start... Oh my goodness. Mudkip has a Wonder Tree cost? Yeah. We'll start Mudkip. We'll put down Rhinehorn. Press done. We'll see what happens. We can Brooklyn for the Vulpix. And just go from there, I guess. Looks like our best bet. Oh, and we go first. Alright, so we'll Brooklet. Use Brooklet. To find a Vulpix. We got the Charizard. We got Meganiums. We got Swampert's. We got the... Oh, we have... Okay, now we have two Mudkips. We got Rhyperiors. So, looks like... We have, do we have the, the, the D... Okay, yep. It looks like we have everything in this game, really. So, get this. Well, Nest Ball. For Chikorita. Looking for three. We have Rick and Meganium. Oh, my goodness. Her hand is really good. We got another Chikorita as well. Press done. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This turn looks so good right now. All right, Shuckle. Beam and discard some stuff. Okay. Yeah, I like this a lot already. Like, we're looking good. He's going to discard some stuff out of his deck. All right, discard some energies. Of course, he has to. He's in a Lolan Eggs deck. Uh, choice Band the Active. Netball. Okay, so we're at Grass Energy. Oh, Trico. So he's playing. Uh, Grass guy. <laughs> I can't remember his name right now. Alright. He's down to 40 cards already. Which is good news for us. The only problem... <coughs> he's going to be one shot of Rhydons. Grass Injective. Tapu Lele. Yeah, just keep on drawing stuff, buddy. It's fine with me. We can kind of tank with Ninetales as well. He's not going to really be able to like really one shot it. Yeah, so that's good. So Lele for... Four, five. I don't know. He's got 34 cards left. Another egg coming down. Okay. Another egg coming down. Okay. Alrighty. So let's timer ball. Good. Great. Good, good, good. Um, Let's Brooklet for another Mudkip. Because the Mudkip probably not going to make it, looks like, right now. Um, let's, I don't know how many, I should have given me Swamp or Surprise, it's good he's Gladiator right now, uh, but let's look for three. Alright, well, we'll just hit their stuff anyway. Okay, so we'll Rare Candy into Meganium. We will, my Quick Ripe in your Herb, the Bench one, I devolve into Swampert. Well, power draw, discard the Celebi. I don't think Celebi's going to be needed in this matchup. Okay, we'll look at a thinner deck. Grab, oh, good, just one looker. Okay. Do we play Ninetales to get the, the guy? I'm scared he's going to knock it out, but I think it's better to draw cards right now. So let's a little Ninetales, yes. Grab this and this. Oh, this is actually going to be better next turn. I should have just waited. Yeah. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter anyway. Doesn't matter. Whatever. Just kidding. All right. <laughs> uh, Sky Pillar. Okay. Sure. We don't need that anymore. Water Dream Top of Lele. Lily. Down to 31. There is a Lolan Egg. So Tropical Shaken, he is uh, he is taking the knockouts here for sure. But he's not going to be one shot the Nine Tails, which is nice. Alright. 
So let's do power draw first. Hmm. I'm trying to think of how we're gonna do this, guys. So let's nest ball. Okay. We could grab a Vulpix, and that way we could chain Vulpixes, like Ace Roll of Vulpix, Ace Roll of Vulpix, and stuff like that. Which seems kind of cute, actually. So let's grab this. Let's, once again, did a check, but we'll power draw and discard the Oranguru. We will... Looking for three. All right, so we got the rare candy meganium. Oh, we could quick crab or quick right, quite whatever. But I'm just gonna press done right now. Okay, so we'll see what happens. <clears throat> He's got thirty cards left. So Grash energy there. Let's see what my opponent decides to do. I really need that Po Town. Po Town can help us like recycle the right barriers. There's a Guzma. Bring it up our Swampers. Oh my goodness! Stop, opponent. Oh my goodness! Tropical shaking for knockout. Goes down to four price cards. All right, we'll send a Vulpix. Uh, look up for three. Oh my goodness. So let's beacon. Just grab one and two. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Man, just keeps one shot of my stuff. Thanks, opponent. You're real, you're real pal. No, have any more swamperts. No more lookers. All our lookers are gone. Uh, we could pal. Okay, so we could pal pal it and back our two lookers. Use lookers to get next turn. It's probably our game plan right now, guys. Probably our game plan. So yep, just a tropical shake for 100 damage. Okay. Goes down to three. We'll send up nine tails. On our turn. We got okay, that's good. So we'll pal pad. Both lookers. Lookers whistle to grab both of these. <laughs> well, lookers for three. Okay. Stretcher into our hand. Grab a Mudkip. We'll put down Mudkip. Quick Ripening Herb, the Mudkip. Okay. <clears throat> um. So I think I'm, I, I could, okay, let's power draw. Discard a Nest Ball, we don't need that anymore. And then we'll press done. Okay, guys, let's see what happens. So I think the game plan is to let it take a hit, ace roll the active, send him a ganium, and then do we start going crazy? We get this. We could do thirteen in one turn, but that's pretty much it. How many ace rolls have we played? Zero, okay. We have nine cards left, just to let you know, as well. The question is, will he actually start playing stuff? He, it looks like he's... Stop! No! Okay, one last try. One last try. We were getting better. We were getting better. Um, okay, let's, uh, let's not play in a Lola Neg deck. Thank you, Prime Gradon. We're coming. I just want one successful de deck out. I just want one successful deck out. 
No, oh, we were doing good that game, I think. I think we were doing good. We're doing good some more? I don't know. Okay. All right. Matt Prof. Got him. Got him. Fighting deck. Okay. Call the coin flip. So we lost the coin flip again. Okay. I think we lost. I don't know. I can't remember anymore. It's been a lot of three games already. A lot of thinking. This is a really complicated deck to play, especially when you haven't. It's not yours to make. All right. So we have a. I think we have a good hand. We can put this down. Put this down. Yep. Press done. Um, we're just missing a, a Chikorita. Ooh, what is this? Zorar Giratina? No. Maybe, I don't know. So Psychic to the active, okay. A hundred, this is perfect. This is perfect, this is what I wanna play against. Can I please play, get some more stuff like this? I don't know what this is, this is Giratina the active and I wanna try this deck off. So, anyway, Lucas Wilson to draw three cards. This card's a Guzma and a Cynthia. Alrighty. Okie dokie, a Malamar deck. That is nice for us. So the NK coming down. Don Wings to Krozma. None of this stuff can really one shot us. A Lilyford 7. Down to 38 cards already. Another NK coming down. Acro Bike. Oh my goodness. Yes, Matt. Keep it coming, buddy. All right, discards a mysterious treasure. Okay, that's unfortunate. Another card must be really good if you want to keep the mysterious, or if you want to discard the mysterious treasure. Okay. My goodness. All right, so let's this. We're definitely grabbing a, a not mudkip. I just see a water Pokemon. Just get excited. Okay, so we got the right. Okay, got two right horns. Got the Chikoritas. Got two Meganiums. Got two of those. Three of these. Our Charmander's prized. Okay. Super is in there. So Charmander is prized. Uh, Brooklyn Hill is prized. Outside of that, I don't know. I think that's everything I care about. So grab this. Looker Whistle for two lookers. We'll look her for three. Okay. We need to find a Chikorita. It's not a Chikorita. Well, we'll switch into Vulpix. He can't attack us next turn. I'd be pretty surprised if he does. Um, we'll grab a Chikorita and a Ninetales. We're going to grab Chikorita and a Swampert. Okay. All right, so our opponent's turn. He's not going to be able to swing this turn, so we can, like, Lookers, Swamper, draw a bunch of stuff, have a big hand. What I'm scared about is Marsh Shadow. So that's why I'm trying to hurry up and build my hand up before Marsh Shadow's up. Like, I'm trying to get the turn to Swamper. <clears throat> get the Chikorita down. Maybe next turn, get another Swamper. Meganium, looking good from there. There we see a Malamar coming online. Okay. He has no Psychics in this card pile. We see an Ultra Ball. Okay. Don't grab Malamar. Okay, not Malamar. <laughs> Don't grab uh, Marshadow. Sorry. So Malamar coming down. Okay. What is he got here, buddy? Invasion. Ooh. Is he going to take a knockout this turn? Does he have Guzma in hand? Oh, boy. Does he have Guzma in hand? That would be upsetting to me. I'll be really upset if he does this. So Psychic. Psychic. Does he have a Guzma? Oh my goodness. Brings the Mudkit up. Well, isn't that unfortunate? Taking a knockout. All right, we don't care what the damage. Damage is relevant to us. Okay. Chikorita, Looker, Mudkip. This and then Beacon Chikorita Got a Meganium next turn. Rare Candy Meganium. Get the other Meganium out. Start doing a bunch of stuff. See, so yeah, let's go with these two. Because we got the Meganium in hand. We can put that in Meganium. Meganium, Meganium to Swapper. Swapper. Um, and then we're, we'll just go from there. Does he have another Guzma? 
Oh my goodness! <laughs> stop it! Every single and the Marshadow, stop! <laughs> Jeez, Louise! Oh my goodness! Uh, okay, let's try it again. Kind of try it all over. Oh my goodness. Um K okay. stretcher for the chicorita. Put down chicorita. I should have held the chicory actually. Or I should have held the stretcher. Um, okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch into something like the right horn. I'm gonna put down Mudkip and switch into it, and just pass. Okay, what we're gonna do next turn is Guzma break up a Malamar because these are only three Guzmas. Okay, so I'm going to Goose Mixer, bring up the Malamar, send to the Vulpix, Beacon. We're going to try this again. <laughs> if he plays the fourth Goose, I'm going to scream. Okay, so shot. I think he knows what's happening. I think he knows what's happening. Okay, so we're going to send a Brighthorn. We're going to Goose bring up. Oh, is he knocked himself out? He did not knock himself out. Send a Brighthorn. Goose bring up the Malamar. We'll go from there. All right, Goose and Malamar, send a Vulpix. Beacon for Ninetales Meganium. All right. There we go. <laughs> what? <laughs> can't even I can what what is happening every single time really jeez opponent he's got a two price cards oh my goodness gracious yep Okay, we're gonna have a stretcher. Yeah, we'll grab these two. This. Okay. <clears throat> Pass. I know Higginock got nine, nine tails next turn to win. I know, I know, I know. Okay, it went terrible today. It looked like today went terrible. Pona had everything every single time. Just sat on four Guzmas, really. Like, that's literally what happened today. Oh, I don't know if we can retreat the Nine Tails next turn. Unless we talk like an Ace Rolla. Sure. <laughs> it's not a card I need. Um, I think we just lose now. My goodness.
All right, one last time. My, like, how, how did that happen? We were looking good. Like, I was like, oh, we got the best play ever. We got the best setup. And then he had the back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back Guzmas on everything. And then with the Marsh Shadow. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Zach Zamora, how do you, how do you, oh, my goodness. I, I, I think the deck is good. Don't get me wrong. But, oh, my goodness. That was insane. No heads. Last one. Good. We won a coin flip. Maybe this is good luck. Maybe this is a good luck sign. Okay. Got this. We got this. We're looking for three. We know Super Boost isn't prized. Okay. Zach did say playing against Marsh Shadow is a tough match. And uh, he was right. That was a tough match. Okay. Okay. Grab Chikorita. So we got the Charmander. Okay, we got three, two, and two. We got the nine tails in there. Uh, I didn't see the Charizard, right? No Charizard's in there. Charmander. We got two rare candies prized. We got no lookers in our hand. Cynthia's not prized. Super boost in our hand. I don't know. It looks like everything's pretty much in here that I can think of top of my head. A uh, whistle maybe prized. All right, whatever. It's fine. We'll go there. Look up for three. Uh, thin our deck out, getting two more lookers. And we'll press done. All right, looker rare candy. Or looker rare candy meganium. <laughs> we are playing against a guardy deck, so like to one shot our stuff, they need a lot of energies. Like 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18. They need 6 energies. Alright, twist me the ring room. Alright, so I feel a confidence. So, fair energy there. Don't know why I attached fair energy to Vulpix. Oh, so you get 9 tails. So, switch. Yep. Okay. Instruct for 1. Okay. Ralts. Beacon. Alrighty. <laughs> okay, let's look up for three. Okay, so I'm putting down Mudkip. I'm gonna. Oh, we've already used one. Oh, we already played a sport card. Sorry. Um, switch into Vulpix. Beacon. For a Meganium. Chikorita. Okay. 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 Don't turn our opponent's turn. We're slowly getting there. We're gonna. We're gonna get this game. I, I feel it, guys. We're gonna get this game. There's nine tails. Can need mysterious guidance. Search for any two item cards. Okay. Just gotta stay calm, Josh. Stay calm. Okay. Let's think about this. How do we do next turn? I don't know. There's a lot of different things we can do here. Once you grab Mysterious Guidance, what, Red Candy, Timer Ball, Nest Ball, Red Candy. So he's got a Guarding Hand, Nest Ball for what, I'm not sure. Maybe another guy, maybe a Cosmog, maybe a Mudkip of his own. I don't know. We'll have to wait and find out, right? That's a mystery. A Vulpix, okay. Red Candy Guardy. Okay. Does he have an energy in hand? It struck for one. 38 cards left. Cynthia for new hand of six. So he goes down to 34. Okay. Does he find an energy knock out Vulpix? Probably. Probably. 
Did he not? Okay, there he goes. I was like, hey, what is he doing? I know he has to have energy. Okay. Um, now, once again, are Meganium and, like, Swampert's, like, they are tanks in this matchup. They are not going to get one shot in. Which are good. That's a good thing. And, like, yeah, he's going to do 30 to somebody, but our Mudkips and Chikoritas and Mudkips have 70 HP, so they're going to be, they're going to be fine for a little bit. I think our plan is to, okay, there's a DC there, so 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. All right, he can do 150 next turn to somebody. If, hypothetically speaking, right? So, Mudkip goes up. On our turn. We'll rare candy into Meganium. Put down Chikorita. Lookers for three. Timer ball? Come on. Yes. All right. So grab Meganium and Swampert. Okay. We'll quick ripen your herb into Meganium. Quick ripen your herb into the Mudkip. Or just Swampert, sorry. Um, we'll trade away the Alolan Ninetales. It's definitely not needed anymore. Okay. And then I'm going to just press done. So my plan next turn is to obviously get another Swamper now. And then we can start using the Rhyperior stuff. What we can do is probably like attach the rainbow, Goose will bring up a Ringaroo, get that stuck in the axe spot, and start discarding cards. Because we got Ace Roll in hand, so that's good. Okay, I'm feeling more confident about this matchup now. About this matchup. We can discard six next turn, hypothetically speaking, and then just keep like ace rolling one back into our deck. And then eventually he would deck out. And like I said, it always it always comes down to how aggressive my opponent wants to play. They cannot be aggressive at all, and then we're in a little bit of trouble. Wait, so it's something prized. So you can see he's like playing passive now. Okay. So let's quick ripening herb. The Swampert. Let's power draw. Discard the lookers. Power draw, discard the Oringaru. Okay. Hmm. We could put down Vulpix. Guzma up his Oringaru. Sin and Vulpix. And Beacon. Grab double right here. Here, okay. Of course, they always have the Guzmas, right? Right, guys. But we got Ace Roll to pick the Meganium back at your hand, and immediately put it back down, which is nice. Okay, so Snowy win. Ooh, I'm okay with this if he knocks out the Vulpix. Okay, so let's power draw. I don't think we're actually... We're not going to need the Celebi. And we're not going to need the Meganium and stuff. So I'm going to just discard the Meganium first. Um, and we'll discard the Meganium. Okay, so we got the Rhyperior now. So we can put down this. We can quick ripen herb this to this. Yes. All right. Well, ace roll of the active. 
send in the Vulpix. Put down this. Quick Ripening Herb. The Meganium. Hmm. And then we'll Beacon. Oh, so what we have is Acerola's prized. And that's what we have prized, guys, is Acerola's. Okay. And Cynthia. Ooh. Yeah, Cynthia's prized, too. All right, Fairy to the Gardevoir. Our Goose was already played as well. Hmm. Interesting. So Snowy went for the knockout. 30 damage there. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's we'll send it right here. Well, Gladian for an Acerola. We'll put down this. We'll put down Potown. Quick Ripen Herb, the Rapierier. Yep. Press done. Okay. 24 cards left. You can probably goose when I got the Swampert this turn, but I'm actually fine if he starts to knock out the Swamperts. I don't really care about that too much. Mmm, so rare candy into another Gardevoir. Okay, that's fine. I kind of wish his deck played like a second. Uh, ooh, so he's going to put some cards back into his deck. It's nice for us. Yeah, I'm fine if he's a knock on the Swamper because that means we can, like, right here. Oh, my goodness. We're getting so close. We're getting so close. I don't want to do this so bad. Oh, my goodness. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18. He's doing 180 damage. Oh, my goodness. Gardevoir, calm down, buddy. Jeez, Louise. 180 damage. Was it a Swamper? Okay. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so let's see here. We could do three, six. We could discard six this turn. Then 13. Hmm. How do we do this? I'm so bad at myself. Okay. So we'll stretch her. Three into our deck. Getting back one, two, and then I guess the Oranguru could be good. Well, Nest Ball for the Rhyhorn. Well, Acerola, the Rhyperior. Put down the Rhyperior. Quick Ripening Herb, the Rhyperior. Yes. Down a 20. Well, Ultra Ball. Discard the Chikorita and this and that thing for another Rhyperior. Quick Ripening Herb, the Rhyperior, yes, down to 17, oh my goodness, we might be able to win next turn, no, we can't take, we can't pick up double Rhyperior unfortunately next turn, okay, so Palpad, back in the two Acerolas, um, Power Draw, discard the Rare Candy, Okie dokie. 
Then we'll press done on my opponent's turn. Fairy to do there. Okay. So it goes down to two price cards. We'll sit it right period. On to our turn. Okay. So we can ace roll the Rhyperior, put it back in our hand, put it back down, quick ripening herb, the Rhyperior, put it down to three. Yep. We're so close, guys. Oh my goodness. We'll go. Uh, we already used Gladian. Oh my goodness. Okay. So. Power draw. Discard the Orange Groove for three. I think we have it next turn. So press. Done. As long as he doesn't target a Meganium, we should win next turn. Oh my goodness, we did it. We can sit up right here. We can put down this ace roll of the right here. Send in this guy. Put down this quick ripening herb into the right here. Quick ripening herb into Charizard. Use the GX tag and we win the game. Yes, I would like to discard top three cards of his deck. And no, we were going to use Charizard. He knew what was going to happen. We finally did it. We did it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that was so much fun. Oh, my goodness. We did it. Oh, <laughs> we did it. Oh, my goodness. And we had we had so many ice rolls prize, but we still did it. Oh my goodness. So you can see how the deck does work. My opponent was even smart. He wasn't even like playing stuff. Oh my goodness, guys. So there we go. That was amazing. So guys, uh shout out to Zach Samore once again for sharing this list, having some fun today playing Meganium, Swamper, Charizard, Rapier. Oh my goodness. But guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button. Go on Patreon and become a Patreon fan. Have a great day. Alrighty. Bye.